starring June Lockhart, Hugh Riley, John Provost as Timmy, and, of course, Lassie. Something wrong? No, not really. I mean, well, it's Lassie. She's frustrated. Frustrated? See, she had a false alarm. That's what the veterinarian said. She thought she was going to have puppies, but she didn't. So we thought she could have one of your kittens instead. You just had eight, didn't you? Well, Miranda just had eight. <laughs> I'm just the foster mother. That's what Lassie wants to be. You mean Lassie wants to adopt one of our kittens? Ever? I sure hope you do. Well, I sure do. All except one. Take a choice. Well, they're all together here. Come on, girl. Let's pick out your new baby. Cute one. Boy, he sure is strong. Here, you play with him. That's the pick of the litter. Good girl, Lassie. You know. Now, if Lassie should decide to come back and adopt one of these little kitties, which better come soon. First come, first serve. Muscle strains, joint pain, and overwork.
Well, she hasn't been around here all day. Isn't she with you? No. I'd better look for her. Uh, after you've done your chores. But, Mom! No ifs, ands, or buts. Okay, Mom. <laughs> wanted to choose her own baby, all by herself. Mrs. Brenner's this morning on your way to school. Mom, for Lassie's sake, can't we try one more day? Not one more hour. Th th that animal is, is too wild. Now that's final. But how are we going to explain to Lassie? She's crazy about her chewies. She doesn't even think he's naughty. Lassie will have to adjust. It'll probably be a little difficult at first. But she'll just have to help her get over it. It's going to be awful lonely for her. You'll have to make her forget. for you. I'm sorry, Lassie. It's not my fault. We had to bring him back. And he is kind of wild, you know. Go on home. Go on. You want to make me late for school?
school today. Yeah. <laughs> Would you mind putting those chickens in the barn now, please? Sure, Mom. Well, no wonder Lassie wasn't sad. She had him hidden in the barn all the time. Oh, Lassie, now why did you do that? You knew you were being disobedient, didn't you? Don't scold her, Mom. She knows what she did was wrong. But it was love that made her do it. Yes, dear, I know. We'll take Hercules back to Mrs. Brenner's tonight, right after supper. Won't we, girl? I'll make sure you come home without Hercules. Come on, Lassie.
should have seen how vicious that mean old mountain lion was. Oh, well, that's not really so surprising, Timmy. She was just acting like any mother would. That was her own child she was after, you know. Lassie sure seems happy now. <laughs> At least this time we know it's not a mountain lion cub. It sure is funny how she changed her mind about adopting that Brenner kitten. Well, perhaps because she knew it was the last one. You know, a, a waif, and it needed protection. Mother instinct's funny that way. Yeah, I guess so. Suppose you and I have a little lemonade, hmm? Sure, Mom. Women. I'll never understand women.